Okay, so I actually bought a pack of tools and stuff like this here to work on your phone. It will hopefully include this. This is a torque wrench, the star tip, whatever you want to call it. Except it's extremely tiny. I have an entire computer repair case about 10 feet away. There isn't anything even close to this size that'll work. So, I'm going to start with this one up here. Actually, that's a Phillips. So the ones down here I'll remove with this torque. There we go. Put that... Put it up there where I can see it. So it looks like there are four down here, about. Uh, actually, no. Well, there should have been four, as you can tell I stripped that one um, and had to drill the head off of it. But uh, it's that plus these three. That there kind of looks like a screw, but it's not. So then I'm going to put that down. I'm going to take the Phillips screwdriver and get this top one out. Now, I've, as I've said, I've done work on this phone before, so maybe it's I ran out of the torque screws and just had to replace it. I had nothing else. I don't know. So now that that's done, we're going to go ahead and try to get the screen out. So on this side, as you can see, it's already popped out quite a bit, all that black. So it's easiest to just try to do it from up here. Just got to... Something else that may come in handy is this. I think it's also called a spudger or something like that. Looks like a guitar pick. Which, fun fact, if you do have extra guitar picks laying around, they can be used for this purpose. So you go around the phone. go. So there are like little clips that are holding the casing on supposedly. So as you can see I'm making good progress there. I got almost this entire side off. If I could just sneak it in here and give it a little pry. Oh, so close. So you probably will have to apply like a pretty pretty good chunk of force just to get this stupid thing out. Run it alongside. Well, basically I'm just going to take this thing and keep going around the edge over and over until it loosens. I'm not going to bore you with that. Well, one thing I just remembered that is probably the entire reason the screen isn't coming off and <laughs> if you've seen some of my other videos when I work on computers and stuff I very frequently forget to do this it is a huge flaw of mine but this is a paper clip it would help if I took out the uh, ooh wow yeah the glass is actually coming up off of there that's not good so I'm gonna go ahead and pop this out this is the SD card and the SIM card alrighty there we go. Oh yeah, that's just really tight in there. Okay, now that I did that, put my keys on the side. Let's try this again. Oh my god. Yeah, there we go. That's the entire... That's just me being stupid and forgetful. So by doing this here, you can take the case off. Oh uh, no, it fell out. So one thing you don't want to lose is the power button. So now, in the next video, I'm going to go ahead and try to play with the battery there.